Hello everyone, welcome back to Healer's Quest. And today we're going to be heading east. <laughs> Lost my directions there for half a second, I don't know why. Can't you switch us back to men? Uh, even if I could, I don't think I want to. You got me into this stupid adventure telling me there was a girl on the team, which was a lie. It's a fitting turn of events, I'd say. Finally, there's much deserved feminine presence in the game. Don't kill him. We still need him. Yeah, that's how this one starts. Fight. It'll be getting, uh, I don't know if it's better or worse. I guess it depends on your point of view, really. Uh, as far as that one goes. But yeah, we're going to be wandering through this forest for a vast majority of this uh, session, so get used to it right now, because we got to get there first. If you can't get there, you're not going to get much done in this game, now, are you? After this, I plan on recording some Subnautica and uh, take a nice sip of my coffee right now. Ah, love me some coffee. I shouldn't drink it. In fact, I, uh, like... Yeah, I really should not be drinking coffee, it raises my blood pressure, but damn if I don't love it. I love it. Excuse me. Also helps with the congestion in your chest because it's warm liquid. It's like drinking hot cocoa, except worse for you. Which is so much more fun. Why are you laughing, Murky? Oh, I just noticed the view is more pleasant now than it was before. Yeah, that's not gonna get you... Yeah. Are you crazy? That was a compliment. I don't know, I don't like... I don't think Grumpy likes that kind of compliment. Fight. So yeah, I, I still... I, I know he probably thinks as long as it's a woman it's cool, but uh, I go with the whole mentality thing as well on top of it. In this case, I don't think Grumpy's really a woman. <laughs> still strikes me as very much a male-dominated personality. So, but hey, I guess Murky... Murky's in the camp of a hole's a hole, I guess, so he don't really care. Hey man, that's your business. Victory! Not mine. So, yeah. Oh, I thought I'd be using a level up. Last chance is not that good. <laughs> I don't know, maybe it is, but I don't want that. Nope. Guys, there's something I don't understand. Okay, I've been transformed to a woman, but why does my shirt suddenly have buttons? They were not there before, and they closed themselves magically. Yeah, that's a shame. We owe that to the new norms of the Ministry of Magic. When I was a kid, if someone turned into a giant or a dwarf, his or her clothes stayed the same. Often giving interesting results. But one day, we've been rated 18 plus because of nudity. Everyone had to make additional research to make the clothes fit the new size of the victim. Now they ask us to dress our victims properly when turning them into women. That's scandalous. You know what, at least they gave an attempt at rationalizing that. I hadn't even thought of that, to be fair. But at least they gave a somewhat... A somewhat, uh, rational reason for that. I don't know if it's a good one, but they tried. It's about as good as you could make with that kind of situation. No, oh, excuse me. I'm still coughing up a storm. I'll be over it in a month. Maybe two. Actually, I guarantee it'll be at least a month because I have a doctor's appointment next month. I'm pretty sure this is where I put my points into remedy because I was like, well, this might be useful. It might be useful having heal on uh, remedy, and it actually is pretty useful. I decided to try to make a new strategy later in this session, if I remember right. It was actually no, I thought I I might have only put a few points in. It. I think later I put more points in because it was so nice. Okay, we're in the end game now. Our build should be nearly completed. Grumpy, are you fed? What? I haven't eaten anything since the game started, so I'm a bit hungry. That's not what I meant. Did you manage to snowball? Does it look like tusk? Or, I'm sorry, don't I don't see any snow. Do you 
I can launch rocks at you if you really want. You're just a noob. I'll report you. <laughs> yeah. Okay, to be fair, Tusk does have an ability called Snowball, but I don't think he's... Well, he is a Snowball character, at least back when I watched Dota 2. Don't know what the meta is now in Dota 2. Man, I remember the, the International 3 when my team won. Of course, that don't mean Jack, but... Man, did I miss EG being good. Anyway. I was never a secret boy, I was always an EG fanboy. Let the Dota 2 crying commence. So anyway, we beat that group and we will be moving on, and now Tanky's got one more defense, and we've got some more stars. This is cool. Ah, another sip of coffee. Doesn't get old. So yeah, we go up to 20 HP per remedy. Because I'm all about that thorough put, baby. If I can multitask and, you know, do that at the same time, why not? Okay, so this group, I just wanted to kill somebody right off the bat quickly. Because my mana is going to be falling like a rock. And I knew it. And thankfully, they obliged me. Because I used all their specials at once. And I am getting better at stopping the mana drain. At the be in the beginning, I didn't hardly even know it was on me. Nowadays, I'm actually stopping it almost as fast as they put it on me, so it's not as bad now. I just listen to uh, the heartbeat. If I can hear a heartbeat, I know I'm mana drained. <laughs> Screw the, the purple rings around Timmy. I don't pay attention to that. I'm not looking at Timmy's, but through, I'm not looking at Timmy through the whole thing, so... Why would I be paying attention to that, you know? But notice, what I should have done is not heal Grumpy there. What I should have done was just Remedy him. Would have, would have healed him and got rid of that, but I didn't. I'm still getting used to the new Remedy, because I'm not used to it healing yet. But, uh... It also is a pseudo kind of insta-heal insta now, because you don't even have to have uh, a thing on you. You can just, um just use it and it'll heal, so, yeah, you don't even really need a, a th uh, affliction on the target. You can do that. I wouldn't recommend doing that, but you can do that. You're better off just using the regular heal, I think, at that point. If you're wondering where I was going, I was trying to see if I could explore this place, but I think this just leads down into an area we've already been to, looking back on it now, but I think that's what I was trying to do at the time. Ah, more coffee. The coffee's about three quarters gone, so I won't be doing that too much longer, sadly. I love my coffee, and I should not be drinking it. It's like how I'm lactose intolerant, but I love cheese. I don't know what's wrong with me. There's something probably wrong with me. It's not like I enjoy discomfort. I just really like things that are not good for me. And yeah, that's just leading back down to places we've already been. That was my... Oh, I was a dummy. But I wanted to explore. I had to see. You have to check, right? If you don't check, what the hell? Oh, man. I'm not feeling good tonight. And this is a longer video than usual, so I'm gonna have to uh, go on for another 17 minutes. I'm sure this was not gonna be this uncomfortable at all for me. And I especially remember towards the end of this that the game started getting really pissy as far as Thoroughput going out, like lots of dying. Because if you remember what Don Shator said, something about he has a date with a succubus. Succubus are the most bullshit things in the entire game just from the sheer amount of damage they throw out. They have like no HP, so that's okay, that's good. But they put out so much, they're like a glass cannon when you finally get to the castle. Like, good god. It, and I think they threw like two or three of you, threw two or three of them at once, along with like two or three other things. Of course, that was last night when I recorded this. I don't honestly remember that in, you know, crystal clear terms, but I think they threw two or three of them at once. Oof. And Murky Level, I've got one more defense. Sweet. trying to decide whether the seven plus seven straight damage or the two damage and five percent critical is worth it and I decided to just stay with the Berserker's Axe just because we need things to die quickly.
Another swig of coffee, another random fight. Yep. And it's more clearing in my throat. So, what can I say about more random battles? At least I'm beginning to use my new remedy a little bit better, because I actually utilized it correctly, instead of healing him and then remedying like I'm used to. Pretty sure this is a... Well, actually, I don't know. I was going to say, pretty sure I might have might regret doing the whole re uh, remedy thing, but, I mean, to be fair, there are a ton of status effects in this game, so maybe not. You know, I like to think I'm doing pretty good here. I don't know, but I like to think that. And yes, I'm just basically using Tanky as a man of battery. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. What's wrong with that? I need mana to keep him alive. He needs to stay alive, so what's, what's the problem here? I don't see a problem here. Oh, man. You know the worst part about this is, when I go back to World of Warcraft healing on a paladin, I'm gonna feel like I have, like, no tools left. Because I'm, I'm playing that when Classic comes out now. You won't be able to stop me with via hell or high water. I will be playing a paladin first. And paladins only have Flash of Light, Holy Light, and Holy Shock. If you don't know what any of that means, congratulations, you probably had a life back in 2006. Uh, Fight. Flash of Light was a short cast heal. Didn't do a whole ton, but it, uh, well, I mean, it was the most mana efficient heal in the game. Holy Light was slow as balls, did shitloads of healing, but was mana inefficient. And Holy Shock was instant, but had like a 30 second cooldown, and it didn't heal for a whole shitload. So you can see the, the, it, the Paladin healing is not very versatile in any World of Warcraft expansion that I played, and that's including Legion, they weren't very good then. Of course I just hated Beacon System then. I was an old school Flash of Light spammer. I was a dirty flash of light spammer, and I liked that playstyle. I want to go back to that day, to those glory days of when you just did not run out of mana. Oh, and every time you crit with the heal, you got all your mana back, and uh... You could damn near hit 100% crit. It was pretty broken. I loved every second of it. <laughs> oh, but until you get to that power gear, you are gonna be less than optimal on a paladin. My goal is to hopefully get back into a Knack skill. If you could get tier 3 on a Paladin, mm, you weren't running out of mana. Well, I mean, if you were a Knacks, I guess you you did, but... You know, other places, no. <laughs> PvP, no. I don't know what I'm supposed to be talking about here. It's just random battles over and over, so I'm just reliving the glory days of World of Warcraft. What do you want me to do here? Seriously, it's the same group almost over and over. What do you want me to do? There's only so much I can talk about. Excuse me. But we're about halfway through the video, it looks like. Wow, I'm back. Way back in the eight minutes on my time. There we are, I'm caught up. I was too busy going on my nostalgia trip to uh, keep up with the timeline. And now I have the hiccups. As if coughing and having to clear my throat repeatedly was not bad enough, now I have the hiccups. Yeah, this is a fun day. Oh man. I was trying to figure out if I actually need to go into the inn. Or I was checking the phone. I was checking the phone. An inn in the middle of this creepy forest? I have a bad feeling about this. Drunken rat. I'm curious to see what the innkeeper looks like. The price is a hundred gold. Do you plan to hurt, steal, or gold, or steal? Go yeah. Do you plan to hurt us or steal our gold? No. Oh, why would I do that? Does the room have beds in it? You're in an inn. Of course it does. I guess we can safely stay then. Why is your jack your inn called the Drunken Rat while you're a skeleton? I tried once, and I had to buy a new bear carpet. Went right through you, huh? Yeah, I know a lot of drunks where the, the booze goes right through them. Ah, uh, that's a double entendre. Not a very good one, either. Ah, oh, I feel like crap tonight. Oh. 
but you won't stop me from doing voice work. Or recording Sonotica, because I've been, you know, I've been looking forward. Not like I'm not looking forward to playing this, but I've been looking especially forward to playing Sonotica, because I've been having, I've been getting a lot of advice on that. Because apparently I missed something very obvious, and I'm intent on finding it now. <laughs> anyway, there's the Ancestral Castle. I must call it the Ancestral Castle. It's Ancestral. The Ancestral Castle, the last stage of our quest. Hopefully. Do you guys know the frightening legend behind Ancestral Castle? No, and we don't care. Just trying to increase the cultural level of the game. Yeah, Grumpy went Lloyd on his ass. No, and I don't care. Welcome to Ancestral Castle. Please make yourselves at home because you'll stay here for eternity. And you should be happy about it. You'll soon become sexy vampires like us. How can, or how can you argue vampires are sexy? In plenty of love stories, the girls always fall for the vampires. Basically. Yeah, that's pure fiction. The truth is your heart isn't beating anymore, so there's no blood that can flow to your dick. That results, you vampire guys are as impotent as an old emasculated priest. You know too much. We can't let you leave alive. Fight. He's not wrong. He's not wrong. <laughs> then again, I never understood vampire love stories. This is coming from a guy who really, I wish I did understand it, because then I could make a lot of money off of it, but I... I can't bring myself to write that, <laughs> because it just doesn't make any sense. Oh, sure, I can make my money off... 18 to 25 year olds, if I re Of course, it'd, it'd be like drivel thrown together for the sake of pandering, but... Hell, that's most novels nowadays, anyway. Oh. Yeah, the exhausting bow. This is what I was talking about. I made a strategy. Considering my remedy heals at the same time, I was like, you know what? I'm going to play to that. I don't know if this is actually intelligent, but that's a lot more damage. Let's see what the Ring of the Lord does. Should do something really good, right? I mean, it kind of does. Excuse me. But I don't know when you ever need to walk on water. Yeah, I saw that weird munchkin guy in the dungeon. Heard that guy is Donchator's in the dungeon, we'll find him easily. We already know he's in the dungeon, genius. Whereabouts? This dungeon's huge. The highest tower of a castle is actually called the dungeon. That's misleading. Let's call that tower the highest tower of the dungeon instead. I can't believe I'm saying this, but I'm actually with beauty on this one. I don't- I didn't know that. I don't know if Murky's talking out of his ass or if that's actually true, but if it is true, that's stupid. And a little bit illuminating on all those tales where you, they show the like the princess in the tall in the highest tower of the or the highest room in the tallest tower or whatever it was in Shrek. Why didn't they call it a dungeon, huh? I guess it's because it was a kids show, a kids movie. They didn't want to say that the princess was locked away in a dungeon. That would give a different, uh, would give an entirely different vibe to the movie, now wouldn't it? Just how I mean, she kind of was trapped in a t in a dungeon. It was dusty, old, and nobody really would ever go up there. <laughs> oh god, yeah, these things. Hey, to the succubi. We don't want to hurt those ladies. Yeah, I don't really... We're succubi... Okay, they're succubi, not succubuses. That's not a word. I doubt we'll be able to act like gentlemen and live. Do people like Grumpy and me really have to act like gentlemen anyway now? Fight! I guess that's a point. Look how much damage they just did! But yeah, they die in like two hits, which is, I guess, balanced, but I don't like it. They do so much damage. So much damage. But that time it was fine. Yeah, I know, I have seven of each. At least I, well, I might have six, I don't remember if I had my drink one yet. Hey, succubi, would you marry him? Depends, how well can you wash the dishes and do the laundry? Fight. Can't tell if that's supposed to be some kind of sexist joke, which, good lord... Yeah, they just blew up, uh, Grumpy almost. And at this point, I'm fucked because I got burned out, and look how much damage they did. Defeat. That's disgusting, isn't it? Fight. It's disgusting. 
how much damage they can do. So you really just kind of just got to burn them down before they can just burn somebody down. Which is why I'm pretty sure he's not supposed to be using Remedy here, but I mean, Remedy... See, they just went from like 90 to zero. What the fuck am I supposed to do at that point? And I'm out of mana. And nobody's killing the succubus. Why is nobody killing the succubus? Well, there's that at least. Yeah, those things do entirely too much damage. But I guess it's balanced by the fact that they have like next to no health. I don't like it, but it's it is what it is. And welcome to the worst fight in the entire fucking castle so far. Do you still clan a Mary a succubus? Heard what she said, you have to be a chores champion for it to happen. You can train to do the laundry with my underpants if you want. You know, with him, I don't think he'd mind that right now. Because he's sick. And you're a woman right now, Grumpy, so you might not want to make that offer if you don't actually want him to do it. Just saying, if I was writing the character, I would have had him jump all over that. I'll make sure every one of us will be in underpants. Now that we have girls in the team, I actually hope it'll happen. Right. Fight. I guess, yeah, these guys are almost as bad as the succubus because they just attack non-stop and do shitloads of damage as well. So, this fight is probably even worse than the succubi, just because they're focusing on the rats first, which I get, they're the frontliners, so, but... Still kind of annoying, considering look how fast they're casting. Why can't Murky cast that fast? I'm out of mana, I can't do anything, and they have like three people left. So, yeah, that kind of sucked. Bad. I should be using Bless, I think. Just from the sheer amount of damage going out, but I'm not. See, that's just disgusting, how much damage that goes out. That's just disgusting. These guys are just awful. Ah, uh, there goes another one. I'm sure this will be the attempt, right? No, we're out of mana. Alright, drink another damn potion then, why not? So that way, you'll at least be at full health when we start, right? That'll make all the difference. That'll make all the difference in the world. And now, well, he's dead. He might be dead, but it's only the three men left now. The, the big troublemakers. And I'm almost out of mana. This could be a problem in the later rounds. I... You gonna be okay there, Tanky? You gonna be okay there, buddy? I don't care as long as you get this kill for me. I don't care, buddy. Kill them all. I know the thing says you might not want to do that with only one person left alive. It's like, yes, I do. I just want this fight to be done. Fuck the rest of them. I don't care. I just want this fight over with, man. I don't care if the other ones are mad at me. And they've ran out of, uh, they've ran out of steam. I'm out of mana. I hope so, you jackass. You screwed me over the first two fights. Victory! Yeah, I don't like that fight with three of those dudes. Oh well. Oh well. At least I got the mana regan, which is a secret spell that I will never use. Why? Because I will never use it, because it's a secret spell. Power of Mana Recovery gives you 4 mana per second for 5 seconds. It activates Murky's special attack during 1 second. You mean after 1 second? I don't know what that means. I think that's what they mean by that. Anyway, we're going back to the end because everybody's near dead. Except for, you know, that guy. And I'm not bribing my way out of this. We're fleeing. <laughs> Give it, as soon as we can get back to the inn, we'll call it a day. As soon as we can get back to the inn. Alright. Welcome back, 100, 100 gold a night. Thank you, you don't need to sleep in here. Everybody else, they need to sleep in here. This is probably one of the funnier ones I've ever seen. Wait for it. What the fuck? A, a meteorite? Ends are definitely unsafe in this country. Party didn't recover anything. We need to ask for a refund. 
And I was about to, because I paid 100 gold for that Regan and I got nothing. I'm glad you survived. You tried to kill us, didn't you? I'm not responsible for astronomical hazard. Furthermore, I lost my inn, mostly. I gave you a 50% discount for life. Alright, let's try that again. I hear the room was cold, but still passed a good night. So that means I got most of their health back. So that's about it for today, everyone. Hopefully I will see you next week. Later, everybody, and have a good one.